Hi everyone, welcome to CD Cave, I'm Jack Burial. Today I'm back with another CD haul. I have one from eBay, one from Amazon, and then I have a few from uh, my local thrift stores. And I also have a few that my neighbor gave me, which I'll be probably showing on my next CD haul. Uh, I haven't went through all of them yet, so I'll be doing that, and then uh, be showing that. Uh, so I hope you stick around for the video. Uh, if you're new here, don't forget to hit uh, the subscribe button, like. Uh, keep those comments. I really enjoy reading the comments. Before I get into uh, my CD haul, um, a few of the uh, viewers have asked about uh, the painting my wife made. Uh, as you know, I have a frog as my uh, my logo type thing. And um, this is the, the final of the painting she did. Um, so I'm pretty happy with that. As you notice, it's got the little sticks uh, picture hanging there. And uh, so this is uh, it fully complete, which I'll be uh, usually leaving here in the background here for my future videos. Okay, so on with uh, the CD haul. So I'm going to start with the uh, Amazon one, which is not open yet. My uh, Dr. Knife here. And we'll start with this one, which is also the great uh, packaging from Amazon, of course, right? I do have an audience today. You can't see her, and my wife's in the background. Uh, the first time watching my video, so if you hear any noise or cheering or something, it'll be from that section over there, which you can't see. Okay, this one here. Put my glasses on, which is a Circus of Rock, which I just got into them in the past month. Um, this is a band out of Finland, and uh, this is um, Merker Rantanen. Uh, he's from a band called King, uh, King Company, uh, originally. And um, he was going to do a solo album and decided to do uh, some type of, like, Aventasia type thing. So um, he has uh, different singers on the songs and that. Um, a lot of uh, lesser known singers uh, here in North America, but very popular out in Europe. Uh, the most popular one he has on this one here is uh, uh, Jeff Scott Soto and uh, Bernie Shaw here, right? Heap. But uh, a lot of great, great singers, a lot of great voices on here, a lot of great rock. If you like um, uh, heavy melodic rock type thing, you know, uh, I wouldn't call it metal. Uh, they call it metal, but I wouldn't call it really metal. But uh, Really great stuff. I haven't opened it yet. I've been streaming it for a couple of weeks. Um, I've actually got their, this is their second one. I've actually got their first one on my, in my cart on um, Amazon. I'm waiting for the price to go down before I order it. But um, yeah, this is uh, really worth checking out. Circus of Rock. The next one will be from eBay, which is a uh, major tape galore on here. I have no idea what it is. It's been sitting around for a few days. Let's see what it is. Oh. Uh. oh, it's a band I've been trying to finish my collection. Yeah, Off the Record by Sweet. Been looking for this one for about four or five years. Um, jewel case, anyways, is what I've been trying to look. It's got some tape on here. It should be hard to open. Yeah, dealers on eBay, they really like to package their stuff really well. Really, really well protected and stuff. There we go. Yeah, I was happy to find this. Of course, they um, they have uh, leave a little card in there, which is kind of cool. Yeah. Yeah, I'm really happy to find this uh, in a jewel case. Very hard to find. They're usually really fairly expensive. I get this one here for around twenty dollars, which I was pretty happy, and yeah, that's including the shipping. So this is a great album. It's got Los Angeles on here, Fever of Love, which are probably the two uh, big hits off here, and the Hard Times is a really good song, and the Funk It Up is probably my favorite song on here, and uh, of course it's a really funky song, but yeah, love the artwork on here too. Okay, the next bunch is from my local thrift store. Um, start off with um, Strays by Junk House. Really good band, a Canadian band. I think they have three 
albums out. Uh, they never really made it really big, but it's got some good songs on there. Jesus Sings the Blues is really good, Out of My Head. Uh, yeah. From 1993. Worth checking off if you're not familiar with that junk house. Strays. Next, well, the next few actually are a bit blues. Uh, John Lee Hooker, Urban Blues. This is really good stuff. I haven't listened to this one yet. I was playing one of his other ones uh, earlier in the week. Uh, really raw stuff, though. Uh, really raw recordings. Uh, Cry Before I Go, Boom Boom, uh, Mr. Lucky, My Own Blues, Hold On Baby. I'm not sure what year this is, but, uh, or if it's even a compilation. From 1983. So I'm looking forward to listening to this. John the Hooker. And another one is uh, Paul James. He's more of a rockabilly type blues player. More of that uh, old style blues. Uh, really good stuff though. Uh, it's another one I have a list. I actually picked up this one today. Uh, Shall I Be Free, Cadillac Walk. Uh, this time I'm really going. Deep River Blues. It's from 1989. Yeah. This is a Canadian present too, so... We're checking out if you're not familiar with him. Uh, next, Loverboy Classics. Not one that I really needed. I pretty much have everything that's on this disc, but I didn't own it, so I picked it up. Uh, Turn Me Loose, uh, Working for the Weekend, and uh, The Kid Is Hot Tonight. Loving every minute of it. Notorious. Yeah. Good stuff. Great Canadian band here, Loverboy. Next, getting a bit heavier here with Seether. I try and pick up everything I see from them. I really like uh, Seether. I like the main vocalist on this band. Um, I haven't listened to this album either. Most of these I haven't listened to yet. Uh, but uh, looking forward to listening to it. Um, oh yeah, I'm not sure what year this one is. But uh, let's see. No. Sometimes the year is easy to find. Sometimes it's not. This one here is not easy to find. 2007, here we go. So, if you're familiar with the album, let me know what it's like. I'll probably listen to it uh, later today. And next, back into the uh, old time blues is uh, Muddy Waters. Muddy Waters, sorry. With the collection. This is a two CD set. So I was pretty happy to find this. It being a two CD set. A lot of classics on here. Long Distance Call. Uh, Where's My Woman? Honky Tonk Off the Wall. Yeah, You Can't Lose. Sad Letter. Yeah. Total Running Time, 105 minutes and 56 seconds. Yeah. Can't beat that when you find stuff like this for $2. Yeah. Muddy Waters with uh, the Gold Collection. So that's it for this CD haul, so I hope you enjoyed this video. And don't forget to leave those comments down below, I really appreciate reading them. And uh, until next time, take care of yourselves.